We begin with breaking details out of surf spot. Surfside Land Swap rejected. Town commissioners vote against trading land so that a memorial could be built in memory of the 98 victims lost in the building collapse. Good afternoon. I'm Maribel Rodriguez. And I'm Francis Wang. The decision made following an emotional meeting with family members of those who died. CBS 4's Peter Dench is live in Surfside with the details. Peter. Well, Francis and Maribel, the proposal was to tear down, tear down the Surfside Community Center right here behind me and build a new one along with a memorial at the collapsed site. Now, as you mentioned, there were some emotional moments in front of Surfside commissioners last night as those who lost loved ones pleaded for the land swap so a memorial can be built at the site of the Champagne Towers collapse at 88th Street and Collins Avenue where some 98 people lost their lives. And a luxury condo will be built in place of the community center five blocks north. But commissioners rejected the proposal for a land swap. We just spoke with Mayor Charles Briquette about this issue. Basically, what would have happened was the community center lot would have become the Champlain lot, and the Champlain lot would have become the future community center lot. Well, it made sense to me to put it on the ballot. I had said publicly that I didn't see personally how it was good for both sides, the swap, because I'm, I'm still unclear on it, and I'm not sure it works for both sides. Um, but I was clear about putting it on the ballot. I urged them to continue to work to try to figure out what the best solution is. Now, one Surfside commissioner said she did not want to see this tragedy exploited for profit and lead to the undoing of a beautiful Surfside Community Center. Meanwhile, some loved ones say they will continue to fight to have this issue placed on a referendum. We are live in Surfside, Peter Dench, CBS 4 News.